Hey guys, Noah Rosenblatt here. I'm from Urban Digs, uh, out in the streets of Manhattan. And uh, I just want to talk really quick about this um, news that just came out about the rent regulations. Uh, the recent rents are now uh, all no fee for renters. Um, this is pretty big news. Uh, my initial reaction for this was, wow, lawmakers are doing this again to us, right? But then I started thinking, this is not a bad thing. Let me tell you why. Um, so consumers are now not allowed to be charged a rental fee, right? That's the basic big news here. Landlords have to pay those fees. So brokers that are doing rentals are like, ah, I'm taking my commissions away. But think about it this way. First, every single consumer that ever said, I'm not paying 15% of a year's rent, or I'm not paying one month rent, that all goes away. So now every single consumer out there has absolutely no reason to not use a broker for a rental because it costs no money. So right from there, I think brokers and consumers on the rental side are gonna have a better relationship here. There might be more business for them. Number two, this is kind of a double-edged sword. Um, I think Albany is trying to make this uh, consumer-friendly, renter-friendly, tenant-friendly, whatever you wanna call it. But in my opinion, it's gonna have the opposite effect. Um, I think landlords are going to end up charging fees. Brokers are gonna be demanding those fees. They're gonna be negotiating that internally between brokers and landlords. And guess what's gonna to happen to that price? Straight up. So if I was a consumer, it's great that you're not gonna to have to pay a rental, but chances are those rental fees are gonna get baked into the price of that rental. And I would not be surprised to see those rents inch up a little bit um, across the board, okay? That's my take on the uh, new rent regulations. This is Noah Rosenblatt from Urban Digs, and we'll catch you next time.